<laughs> you know, we 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 hear about uh, celebrities like Al Pacino, eighty three years old, just had a child. Mm -hmm. um, what is it? Uh, who, who who's the guy who's always with him? Um, Robert De Niro. Robert De Niro, yeah. yeah. Seventy nine years old, just had a child. Mike, Mike, are you ever gonna stop having children? Like, yeah. is it in the, is it in the plan this, for you? Yeah, this was the last one. How are you so sure? But look at Alicia. <laughs> how, how old is your youngest? My youngest is six. Mm -hmm. I can do it. This one, was, this one was planned. This one, yeah, this one was, this one was planned. planned. Yeah. Okay, so y'all are shutting down shop. Twenty eight yeah, tonight. The factory is closed. Well, this one was planned, but it was planned to have twins. Didn't happen, but nonetheless, a blessing still came out of it. So, you know, Mike, I I, I know you're in the entertainment industry. Um, you're doing movies, you're acting. Have you guys ever solicited or been solicited to do reality TV? Because this is a hell of a yeah. Situation. We actually. I, I, I don't think I can say it in this interview, but we actually, um, we were shopping a reality show for a while. I went with different production companies and just the math wasn't adding on some and then the situation wasn't adding on others. Um, but we just literally signed a deal May 25th with a major production company. Mm -hmm. um, so now we're, we're in the developmental stages with that. Are you guys in any way fearful, um, not for yourselves because you're adults, but for your children, I mean, reality TV, it, it, it you know. Well, we talk to them, we talk to mm -hmm. them. And, and it's, it's probably different than it was years ago because people look at reality TV as exploitation of your family, of your kids or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of different now because you have social media and so many things out there where, where our life is being shown, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Um, so why not get paid for it, right? And we're in the, process of, of showing how it works right. you know what I mean that, now will there be some drama in it yes will there be some chaos in it yes but the children all of them know they can't capture anything that you don't give them right so they say so they, so they know already about the cameras and stuff and anything that they don't want on tv or see again they won't do and prior to the decision being made we asked them if they yeah, were we okay with them, them and they had you know decision. are they okay with us you know moving forward to do this and they all agreed. So we never really just make a decision with just us. We always include the children because it's also going to have an impact on their lives as well. And there's two, there's two that don't want to be included. And that's okay. Mm -hmm. They know that they don't have to be included. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I heard you mention earlier that you work with Nick Cannon um, in Wild and Out. <laughs> <laughs> about his situation, because it feels like almost every other month, He's having a new child, but unlike you guys' situation, I, I don't know his arrangement, but I don't think he's married to any of the women, and, and there are a lot of women. You guys have a very contained situation, and it, and, and it appears to be a love from the top down. Not to say it isn't in his situation, because we just don't know, but do you look at a Nick Cannon like, what... What the heck are you doing, or do you just understand? I, I really don't have an opinion on it because to each his own. I like you said, we don't know his situation entirely, and I've never discussed it with him. Um, the conversation that we had, he was getting insight on my family, you know. Mm -hmm. Um, but I don't I don't know his arrangement. You know, if I look in the media and see some of the things, I see him spending time with his kids and doing different things, you know. Mm -hmm. Um, and of course I know he could take care of them. You know, but as far as the nurturing part and, and making sure they good, I don't I don't know. There's arrangements here. I don't know what conversations he has with the mamas or, or the babies. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.